thank you for taking the time to do the demo. Yeah, of course, no problem. Do you want to show me the package? Of course. Um, let me put it in. Perhaps we also can uh, do a flight. It is a little bit uh, windy, but we, uh, we can check if we do, uh, if we do a flight. I think, I think the, the Mavic will manage. Um, as you can see here, it's a flight case uh, with the Mavic bows on. I will go to demonstrate you that later. Um, the flight case is custom fit. Uh, it is the 7 inch LCD uh, with integrated uh, 5.8 GHz receiver. Um, handheld for the thermal. We also have a tripod uh, optionally so that you can install the, the 7 inch LCD on the, on the optional tripod. Um, with built-in charger. Um, this is for the, for the battery holder. Um, it is also possible if you got the combo package uh, to install uh, the battery hub in here that you can charge the three batteries uh, in chain which allows you to have uh, always full charge battery uh, and you're good to go. Um, can you show me how it works? Yes, of course. We have... Um, oh, grab it with me. Uh, on the Mavic there are two cameras installed, uh, this is the boson, this is the original DJI camera. Um, you can aim it forwards or for example 90 degree downwards. This is quite used often for uh, search and rescue purposes or uh, spotting farms uh, for applications like that. Um, there are, uh, oh wait, what I'm going to tell you uh, is that we also have two screens. Uh, you have your, your GDI Go app, or if you use, if you want, you can also use Ground Station. This is very handy for, uh, for search and rescue, or if you're searching fields, then you can pre flight, uh, set the flight course, uh, but then you need to install the, the iPad, um, uh, iPad Mini on it. On it. Um, on this one, we now have the uh, LCD, this is the second screen for the thermal view. So you have daylight and thermal view simultaneously. Um, if you can take a look here on the buttons, there are three buttons um, which allows you to swap between the pallets. So I'm going to press the middle button and then you can see uh, that it will switch between the pallets. So now this is white hot, black hot, and uh, some other pallets. And um, this is also a pretty neat feature. Uh, this is, we like to call it the relotherm. This pallet is basically uh, highlighting uh, the, the temperature uh, which is the hottest in the field of view. So then you directly see uh, the, the hot spots. So if I'm aiming in the field that you directly will see uh, the animals which are uh, highlighted very clear clearly. And you can with the left and right button you can uh, adjust uh, the contrast of this, um, uh, of this, of this highlight uh, color. Can you demonstrate a little fight for me? Yeah of course, it's no problem. It's a little bit windy so I hope uh, it's okay, but we can uh, give give it a try. I'm going to take it, uh, take a spin over the field here. Uh, perhaps you can take uh, take a look at the uh, the thermal LCD. Perhaps you can spot an animal or anything. Now, by the way, I've aimed um, I have aimed the um, the camera 90 degrees downwards. So. Um, would provide a very good image uh, from above.